Hello everyone, this is Tuesdays with Suzanne and we are here talking today about when you have something that is upcoming that you know is a challenge and for some of us in our lives right now it might be seeing family in the upcoming holidays, for some of us it might be about meeting the challenges that have come up and around you as the pandemic has gone on and on and on and things that are coming up are, are things you have to meet that are not pleasant perhaps they're not something you're looking forward to and when you're challenged when you are when and you know something's coming how can you meet it in a way that allows you to bring all of you to the circumstance and to be the best you can be in that circumstance okay so what I'd like to do today is to build on the last four weeks we have talked about the portals to healing and feeling whole and the different inner resources that each one of us has even if it's just a small one even if that file is very thin in your brain in your memory of your body even if that is not something you've experienced a lot of oftentimes you can still bring back the feeling of a time when you felt loved or a time when you felt like you were able to love someone fully then there's when you felt supported the portal of feeling supported a time when you felt supported when you felt a sense of connection between you and the world and the final one that we did last week was a time when you felt a sense of safety safety so these are the four portals that we've been talking about for the last month. And I'd like now to take them and bring to mind for yourself something that may be going on in your world that is very challenging and maybe you don't know the answer yet. Okay? So put your feet on the floor. Allow yourself to drop in. Sink back. Feeling your feet. your legs, your sitting bones, breathing in a way that feels relaxed, relaxed, yeah. Yeah, and take a moment, take a moment and feel the connection of your feet, the soles of your feet, that they are resting on the earth beneath you without any effort on your part because of the natural connection that we have as human beings to the planet, to the planet. Yeah. So breathing that in. And personally, I love putting down roots, becoming the tree, Whatever kind of tree works for you, but whatever metaphor works for you, use it. Allow yourself to feel the ground beneath you and to soak up from the earth what would nourish and nurture you most. I do it most easily on my breath. So as you breathe in, imagine you're breathing in from the earth into your feet and legs, whatever sensations would feel most nourishing and nurturing to you. Good. On the next breath, allow this flow to continue on into your pelvis, your sacrum, your spine, your belly. On that third breath, allowing your heart and your lungs, your chest, your ribs, your shoulders to fill and soak in nourishing sensation from this flow that's continuing. Good. Good. Yeah. And allowing this flow to move down your arms into your hands and fingers.
and then allowing it to move right on up into your throat, your neck, your face, and your cranium, your brain. Right on out the crown of your head, showering down around you. Yeah. Good. Good. Yeah. Now take a moment, and if you want to, if you want to practice with these four portals of health and healing and inner resources, bring to mind whatever your upcoming challenge is, whatever it is. It might be meeting someone or a circumstance where the outcome is unknown or something that has been very frustrating for you in the past. Take the whole circumstance. Take the whole circumstance and how you want to meet it. And as you hold it, right out there in front of you, whatever it is, allow yourself to bring to mind a time when you felt safe and where do you feel that in your body? I notice that when I bring up a time when I felt safe, that I feel it in the back half of my body. I feel it in my backbone and my legs and feet, my bones. And wherever you feel it, bring that sense of embodiment and feeling safe as you look at this circumstance. And you may notice that when the circumstance is in your vision, but you're feeling safe, that a little bit of the charge leaves it. Yeah? Okay. And then take a moment, and let's look from the portal of being connected. Remember a time when you felt connected into your environment, into your world, to the earth beneath you. Bring that, open that file, that memory, and the body memory of what it felt like to be connected. Good. Good. Yeah. Yeah. Good. And notice as you sit in this sense of connection. that a little more of the charge leaves that challenging circumstance. You may not really see the answer yet, but the charge leaves. It just dissipates a little bit. Yeah. And then take a moment. And remember a time that you felt loved, deeply loved. And as you bring up that file folder called Being Deeply Loved, for some people it's actually a feeling of loving someone so deeply that the connection is there. Either one of those works. Feel the body memory of being loved deeply, deeply. Good. And notice as we walk through these four portals how the, the charge 
of that challenging circumstance. It's as though they dissipate whatever's coming up there for you. Yeah. You may not have the answer yet, but it's as though you're seeing the circumstance from different facets of the prism. When I feel loved, this is how I see it. When I feel connected, when I feel safe. Yeah. The final portal is a feeling of being supported. Supported. So open that file in your body memory, in your brain. Remember a time when you felt supported. It can be moments ago or it can be 25, 40 years ago. doesn't matter. Bring back your body memory of being supported. Notice with this final of the four portals, being supported, that it changes yet again, looking at this circumstance, slightly different position. When I'm feeling supported, this is how I feel. This is what's happening. Yeah. Good. Good. And know that these body memory files, if you want to call them that, these places within you that light up when you remember these four different circumstances of being loved, being supported, feeling connected, and feeling a sense of safety. But these four, all of us have had some level of being able to feel them, even if it was only for a very short period of time, somewhere in our lives. And that when you do that, it allows you to step into a slightly deeper embodiment for meeting the challenge that's coming. So play with these. Play with these. Remember them. Remember them. And enjoy. Enjoy.